Maja John Ned and Veracruz in the marina section, just block and a half west of Hotel Mari Tierra. The Moye is over there. The bay is over in that direction. And I spent about an hour bobbing around in the bay this morning. And I'm wanting to talk about the benefits of just being in the water. Just being in the water. It's one of my, I have two products, primary products I'm gonna be offering in Cozumel. One is being with Majo because since I spiritually woke up four years ago, I'm real good at being, and I want to help other people do that. But the second one is being in the water with Majo. And my experience from about two years of following the Gulf Coast now is that adults don't get in the water much. They may sit in the very shallow water, Mexicans more. Uh, all through Texas, adults would stand in the shallow water and check their emails or sit on the beach or walk on the beach but it would be the kids who would get in the water and I said they're missing so much I started my trek towards a sleepy little beach community in Mexico that's my fantasy and maybe I still will find that in Cozumel but I started that journey because in Kentucky in Kentucky when I swam in a little man-made lake the weightlessness just brought me back to God. And when I came up on the shore, I said to my little chihuahua, what's with this gravity bullshit? <laughs> All of a sudden, I'm heavy. So I knew there's something awful special there and started experimenting on the beaches. If there's a lot of chop, just sitting in the shallow water and letting the water toss you around and it makes you a kid again. You giggle. I got people doing that. So one of the main things I want to do in Cozumel, if I really land there, which I'm hoping I will, uh, is to get people back in the water.